These inspections obviously relate to all areas of the aircraft. The following slides will show the major differences, especially in relation to EWIS. As we saw in the previous module, inspections are carried out based on a scheduled maintenance program applying the directive stated in the ESAP or following on from a standard inspection. Electronic devices are really sensitive to electrostatic discharges. Chapter A2 lists the measures to take so as to prevent any damage from occurring because of this phenomenon. All operations on wiring must be carried out in compliance with the good practices and appropriate tools listed in the manufacturer's documentation. All connectors, such as air, fuel, or hydraulic pipes, must be protected so as to prevent any pollution and contamination. Access to the inspection zone. Difficult access can have an effect on interpreting faults and on the motivation and attitude of the person carrying out the inspection.